remember that personnel of the MTTD, the patrolmen and women in our communities, roads and highways, as well as those of us manning our various charge offices across the country are the face of the police. The image challenges we have had over the years of our existence can largely be attributed to the attitude of these men and women who you supervise. It is sad, but worth stating without missing words at this conference that a lot of us have stepped on the slippery moral slope and with initial justifications of a few unethical behaviors, we have shamelessly graduated into full-blown ethical viruses, slippery very fast, slipping very fast down the slope and infesting all your subordinates and peers. If the future of the service will continue to win the confidence and support of the general public, as well as some key strategic players in the country and beyond, we ought to change our attitude. In fact, and indeed, attitude is everything. Without it, nothing happens. The MTTD is mandated to ensure that road users are there to traffic regulations. However, unacceptable recurrent deaths on our roads has challenged our collective conscience to, to do things anew. It is my sincere belief that this conference will provoke a rethinking an attitudinal change in all of us, a change that will inure to the benefit of the Ghanaian people, a change that will demonstrate an MTTD that respects the dignity of the citizenry, a change that will showcase the new MTTD with a much more sharpened professional leadership across the command chain. Let us all one day retire and drive through our roads and highways to witness a more professional MTTD capable of enhancing the image of the service, preventing the needless accidents in collaboration with other stakeholders, and enforcing all traffic regulations with the highest level of impartiality.